Hello, this is how to make a pressure vessel to uh, uh, cure your resin if you're woodworking or um, uh, any resin if you want to remove the um, bu bubbles from it. So you just go get a used pressure cooker, just like that, from somewhere, from a thrift store, from somewhere, an old one, it's very cheap. And that's what I did. I just got one, and this is it's a different one, but this is the result. I just removed the uh, stem valve and the uh, pressure release. This is pressure release, and that's the seal. And I placed the gauge. Got a gauge from a uh, store and a valve and an inlet and I uh, screwed them in there and this is my pressure that's those five quarts take some piece of wood small piece of wood if you wish and this is what I, what happened and the um, I took and oiled the rubber gasket and cleaned it after cleaning it and it was in horrible shape but I took some time to clean it just with a, a scrubby uh, OR brush and sanded the surface a little bit to make it a little bit more clean and that's all there is to it really and then close it and if you want to see it I can take it up to 80 PSI I didn't take it over that because I do not, we do not need that much, maybe 40 or 50 PSI is enough. So, I'm going to take and place my uh, gauge, uh, my uh, hose in there. Sorry, I got to put it down a bit. I'll pause. And there's the... Uh, Hose, just put it in simply, and then we turn on the uh, compressor by connecting it. Two hands, maybe something. Like holding pressure now at 60 psi for now yes it does air out a little bit nothing is perfect in vacuum but it will hold it for a while maybe 50, you know, 30 40 minutes or so and then it will air out and that's all there is to it you can keep maintain it keep it connected to your uh, uh, compressor and adjust the gauge on your compressor to whatever pressure you need and it will maintain the pressure uh, for that length of a period of time that you want and that's the, all there is to it and that's it simple and then now we can connect the, disconnect the hose and once you're done That's it. And it can take a little bit of stuff in there. Hope you guys enjoyed it.